I'm excited. Uh, excuse me. I did not expect the camera quality to be this good. Actually, yeah, I did. Looks even better than my camera. I'm using the HD quality right now. I'm not using the 4K because I'm not trying to waste my gigabytes. Rhombus, trapezoid. to get my teeth whitened. The guys who are doing the construction usually come around eight. So the banging starts from eight and doesn't end till five. And I don't know, today I just wasn't in the mood. Yeah, I'm about to go now. So I may film a little bit there. Not sure, but I guess we'll see. All right, so a lot has changed since the last time I showed you guys anything. So they are adding vaulted ceilings to the ceiling. Um, I think they're just doing like one more, I guess, bar here. The closets are done. There are like closet lights in there. The AC unit was put in here. We also had one put downstairs inside the dining room. And then for the bathroom, a lot of changes happened. So the lights are on, the lights for the shower were put in. They even added the vent. So this is the shower area. It's looking very, very pretty. It's still not done. We don't have the marble slab yet. We're waiting for it. They're gonna create a shelf in the middle. So here is going to be the toilet, which they haven't put in yet. And then this is the vanity for the double sink. They added like a new frame for this window and they added a frame for the sunroof. All right, so giving you another house update. You can already see what has changed. The vaulted ceilings are in, and I'm officially a believer. At first, I wasn't sure where my parents were going with this. This looks really cute. I think they should leave it this color. The doorknobs are in. This doorknob is so cute. Um, this is the doorknob for the bathroom. Same type of idea, except it doesn't have a lock. It has like one of those like privacy buttons. Now they left food here, the workers. The vanity was put in. Vanity's very cute. They have that double sink action going on and the sink does work. Um, we did encounter a little bit of an issue down here. My parents didn't realize that they were going to, I guess, make the plumbing look like this. They thought that they're gonna hide the plumbing. So yeah, they're not really happy about that, but it is what it is. What can they do now? But the vanity is nice. I love that it's self closed. The toilet has been put in and the shower shelf has also been put in. It looks so nice. This looks like a nice like Spa shower looks so pretty. I love, love, love the marble. The bench is huge. It's so nice. And yeah, the shower is really pretty. I love it so much. So they got French doors for their closets. The French doors are gonna look so nice. They're gonna have the matching handles in here, which is gonna look really good. They added like a little barn door for that closet. Well, I'm not a fan of the door that the contractors picked to then cut. To use as a barn door, I feel like they should have used an actual barn door, but I guess that's just like a communication issue. And once the floors are redone and stained, everything should come together. So yeah, that's it for right now. The last update I give you will probably be the final update when the project is completely done because we're pretty much at the home stretch. 
um, they just have to like fix like a few like things that aren't right. I think they are also stating the vaulted ceiling so I like them like this but I guess like wood has to be treated or something. I don't know. I don't know much about construction. That's it for my parents room and their bathroom. I'm going to take you guys down to the guest bath to show you everything that's going on. Yesterday there was a huge flood down there so I was down there with my dad cleaning everything up but that's the different story. guys so i'm in the guest bath right now and i'm just like finishing up getting ready i feel like i'm always in here lately but um i haven't filmed in so long like the clips that you just saw were filmed two weeks ago i just basically haven't been feeling myself i've been very just like in a bad place and when i'm in a bad place I I just can't film but I've been doing a lot better lately I've been reading my Bible a lot more that's probably why I've been so down because I just stopped reading my Bible as much as I used to but yeah I've been doing a lot better and I will be uploading a lot more just let me know like what you want to see from me like this coming year I definitely want to I guess like not take such long breaks like this anymore, like disappear for two weeks. I tried to do something cute with my hair and it's just not working out. Maybe I need earrings or something. Just to end off the vlog, I'm gonna show you a few things that I got from Yes Style. It's not sponsored or anything. I'll link everything down below, but I will be linking affiliate links. So if you guys wanna shop with my links, that'll help me out. It feels kind of weird to be doing a haul in a bathroom, but there isn't any good lighting anywhere else, so. So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably have already seen this. This is the Niagara Falls Canada t-shirt. This is so cute, very good quality. I love this so much, I can just like live in this. A lot of the stuff are only one size, but they do come pretty oversized, so it's not like super small. I got this cardigan, super cute. It doesn't really fit my boob area, but I am obsessed with this color. It looks so good on my skin tone. And then I got this really cute mock neck shirt, and I also got it in blue. I just changed my hair again because I felt like my hair looked really weird, but I feel like it still looks weird. I got this turtleneck sweater. I think the neck is a little bit awkward. I don't know if I'd totally recommend this, when I put it on, it just feels like my head is like, like imagine this like being like a circle and then like your head is like a stick in the middle. It's just so big and like it doesn't, it's just awkward. It's an awkward top. I got this graphic tee. I got this sweater expecting it to be kind of like more sweatery. I mean, the inside is very soft, but the outside is very shiny. It's giving me dad vibes, but I kept it because I really like vintage looking things and I don't think it's that bad but I just wasn't expecting the material to be like so shiny and not more like sweatshirt material kind of. This last item you guys have already seen because I wore it in a haul video but it's this uh, v-neck type of sweater vesty sweater. I love it because again it has that like vintage look. I really like vintage looking things. And it's just really cute. Yes style is not forgiving when you are a little bit taller. So make sure you watch like the arms, like actually measure your arms and make sure that's okay. I'm just not feeling my hair. I'm not feeling it. I tried to make it look cute and I'm not succeeding. Um, all right, well, if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram if you want to keep up with me outside of YouTube. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.